Thomas Reynolds listed becoming a marine pilot and having a happy family as his future ambitions in the 2013 Lemonster High yearbook. He became a marine pilot and had just gotten married. He was exactly what you would want your son to be. Captain Ross Reynolds and three other Marines were killed Friday when their Osprey aircraft went down during a NATO training exercise in northern Norway, a mission unrelated to the war in Ukraine. Lemonster High's principal was Reynolds' guidance counselor. He was involved in our wrestling team, robotics, Eagle Scout, uh, exactly what we hope every kid is here at Lemonster High School, a great role model. So now, you know, his legend will live on. This morning, teachers and staff who are veterans lowered the flag outside the school. We also had a, a parent, uh, Pauline Roberge, who had lost her son serving the United States military as well in Iraq. Reynolds' family wrote in a statement, quote, we are broken hearted. Left trying to imagine our lives without Ross, we are in shock and devastated by his loss. Clearly, he was driven, you know, to serve his country, to fly an aircraft. The city's mayor and high school principal remember Reynolds today from years ago as the patriotic kid who was driven and going places. You could just tell at a young age, anybody that knew him said he's on a mission. He was the best in doing what many of us can't do, right? Serving our country and eventually paying the ultimate sacrifice at a, at a very tough time. Captain Reynolds leaves behind his wife, mother and father and his sister. The mayor says he also has a large extended family here in Lemonster. They are all now waiting for him to come back home. In Lemonster, Jennifer Egan, WCVB News Center 5.